My name is Alex Hartwell-Pendo. I'm 12 years old and in 6th grade. I recently lost my grandmother to heart disease. Heart disease is the leading cause of death in the U.S. and is also the leading cause of death for both men and women in the U.S. and the leading cause of death worldwide. It accounted for 16.2 million deaths just last year. My invention called Hartwell-Pendo, a play on words for my last name, Wapendo means love in Swahili, and the app name means Heartlove. It's an early detection app and phone device that helps prevent heart attacks and stroke. My app is equipped with Bluetooth algorithms and a phone case that has a built-in ECG. One of the top three items that people carry 80% of the day is their phone. The Hartwell Pendo case has a built-in ECG. You simply place your fingers on the side of the cell phone case and in 30 seconds it will record an electrocardiogram. The heart is a muscle triggered by electrical signal. The signal can be recorded and is called an electrocardiogram, or ECG. Before we dig deeper into the fundamentals of ECG, let's go through the basics of heart physiology and function. The heart has four chambers. The upper two chambers, left and right atria, are entry points into the heart, while the lower two chambers, left and right ventricles, are contraction chambers that will send blood out to the body. The circulation is split in the loop with the lungs, pulmonary, and another loop through the body, seismic. And the cardiac cycle refers to a complete heartbeat from its generation to the beginning of the next beat, comprising several stages of filling and emptying the chambers. The frequency of the cardiac cycle is reflected as heart rate, beats per minute, or BPM. ECG records the electrical activity generated by heart muscle depolarizations, which propagate in the pulsating electrical waves toward the skin. Although the electricity amount is in fact very small, it can be picked up reliably with ECG electrodes. Electrodes are an electric conductor, usually metal, used as either of the two terminals of electricity, conducting medium. It conducts a current in and out of the medium, which happens to be my phone case and the scan of your hand. With the web handle heart, if you feel an episode is happening, you can immediately grab your phone case and take measurements because of the three electrodes, two on the side of the phone case and another on the back, where you hold it during the measurement. Those measurements are then sent via Bluetooth to our app. Inside the app's algorithms, it will pull data and chart it next to safe ranges of stats. If your ECG is out of that range, it will advise you to seek medical attention. It will also give you one minute to respond after the reading by prompting you to press any button on your dial pad. By pressing the button, it alerts the app that you are coherent, don't need emergency help. If by any chance we're having an episode and don't respond to our app's alert, it will pull GPS information through my app and will send a call to local authorities as well as contact your emergency contact. One out of three people will suffer a fatal heart attack from heart disease. Help me keep loved ones around longer through my early detection app, Heart with Pendo.